Something we've been talking about on this channel for a long time is the sheer volume of both small arms ammunition and munitions going over to Europe from uh, not just the private sector of the US, but also the military sector of the US, the private sector of Europe, as well as the military sector of Europe is all going over there. And everybody, all people involved are saying they just simply cannot keep up. Now what we're looking at is they're wanting to ramp up production of ammunition going over there, significantly ramp it up. So let's just talk about munitions like 110 millimeter shells. Right now they're producing on average about 20,000 a month here in the US. They're wanting to produce 75,000 a month uh, within the next year. Also, in addition to that, amping up exponentially uh, small arms ammo, as well as really all the munitions going over there, but none of it's gonna go to you and none of it's going to our military. It's all going to foreign militaries. Now, the problem with this is really the same thing that we had whenever we were dealing with the ammo shortage a few years ago was that it was really a raw material shortage. Um, it's not like, I, you know, they're taking all my 110 millimeter shells, <laughs> but it's the, the raw material that goes into making the primers. Uh, every th aspect of that is, is much larger scale. Um, so right now, Pentagon, uh, the U.S. Pentagon is saying they intend to massively ramp up ammunition production uh, within the next few months up to a year. So if you look at current production of both small arms ammo and all, really all the munitions that are taking those same components, uh, we're looking at fourfold on the larger and tenfold on the smaller is what the U.S. Pentagon is shooting for. Now, uh, no pun intended there. Now, what I will say is that I think anybody that wants to ramp up production of ammunition, this is a good idea, especially when you're saying you can't keep it up. So this is not a doom and gloom video. This is good news uh, because they are ramping it up significantly. But the, the bad news is that it's all going elsewhere and, and all those raw materials are also going elsewhere. Uh, this is really the problem. Ramping up production, not a problem. Sending them elsewhere, that's a problem. So again, I'm gonna kind of go back to that raw material issue. All of that is getting consumed and being sent. Again, ramping up production, great idea. Sending it all over there, this is a really bad idea. Um, but any thoughts or insight, especially any insight you might have, you know, here at Lake City Ammo, that's production going up a big amount. But again, that's not making its way to us at all. So any insights you might have on this, definitely put it in the comments below. If you like this video, click like and subscribe. Feel called to support this channel with Patreon. That link is also below. But the most important part of this channel is we take prayer requests. So please don't ever hesitate to send that in. Thank you for watching this episode of God, Family, and Guns. And as always, love God, love your family, love guns. Thank you.